What's going on YouTube and thanks for coming back for another video. Alright guys, so today's video is going to be pretty quick. Um, I'm actually just going to be trying out a product I've been seeing around for a while. Uh, I finally got my hands on some a while back and today I'm going to test it out see if it works. So let's go take a look what I'm talking about. Alrighty guys, so the product I'm going to be trying today is from Simple On Solution. It is their liquid soil loosener, which is basically an aerator. So it's like a liquid aerate. Um, but yeah, I've been seeing this around for a while, guys. Uh, and I was like, you know what? Let me buy it and see how it works. So it says on the back of the label, it's supposed to be good for uh, water improvement and breaking down the soil. It's basically, like it says, it's going to aerate your lawn. because It's, it's going to help get more water and air into your lawn. So that's going to help it grow better and, you know, add more nutrients to your lawn as well. So um, let's go ahead and try it out, guys. All right, guys. So before we actually use it, what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna I'm gonna use this rebar. That's all I could find for right now. I'm gonna poke the soil. Let's see how far we go in. I'm gonna spray the lawn with the liquid aerate. Come back uh, maybe about two or three days, and we'll see if it uh, actually has worked or not. So let me go ahead and try to put this in the lawn. See how far it goes, and then we'll go ahead and spray the lawn after. So that's how far I got it. Let me see if I can measure how far that went in. Okay. So I've got a measuring tape real quick. Alright, let's go ahead and measure. Uh, so I would say about six and a half, almost seven inches, which uh, actually I thought it would be less than that, but I did use some force, I would say. I wouldn't say a lot of force, but I did use some. So after I spray this and come back in two days, let's see if it goes deeper or maybe it'll go a little easier into the soil. But um, yeah, let's go ahead and spray, guys. Actually, guys, I'm gonna try this little area over here that you can see that area gets sun basically all day so it's actually pretty pretty um compact this area right here versus this area which is nice and soft because it gets it gets quite a bit of shade actually so the real test is going to be right over here so let's see how far i can go in with it I'm actually trying pretty hard and maybe half an inch if that so this is gonna be a good test for that liquid area and see if it works right here in this area so let's go ahead and start spraying guys all right guys so to spray this you can do it two ways you can use a hose and spray which I'm gonna be using today but you can also use a pump sprayer so whichever one you have you can use and you want to just follow directions on the back of the label for example the hose and sprayer, you're gonna pour in one ounce per thousand. Um, so back here, it's roughly a little bit over 800 square feet. I'm just gonna round it up to say it's a thousand. So I'm gonna be adding one ounce to this and then filling up the rest of water, plug it in and then just spray the lawn. So let's go ahead and do that right now. All right, so once you add your, kind of hard to tell, but it's only one ounce that I add. But like I said, this is roughly 800, over a little bit over 800, so I rounded up to 1,000. So it's one ounce 
per thousand square feet of, of your lawn. So I added one ounce. Next, I'm gonna fill all the rest with water, top it off, and then I'm gonna go ahead and spray the yard. All right, guys. Next, we're just gonna plug in the holes to the back and ready to spray. guys just in the spring I'm trying to show you guys this I don't know if you can see right here it's kind of bubbling it kind of looks like soap on there so so far it looks like it's working I guess you can say so after you spray your lawn next thing you're gonna do is water it it says on the bottle about 20 minutes after so I'm gonna go ahead and water it and we'll come back and um, I'll say by maybe about two days and then we'll come back and do the test here again Alrighty guys, so this is three days after I applied the liquid aerator. So let's go ahead and test it out with the rebar and see if it uh, that, if it helped or not. Let me get the rebar first. Alrighty guys, here we go. As you can see guys, it actually seems to have worked before I could not get this thing in the ground at all. Maybe half an inch if that, but I mean, this is probably, let me see. This is roughly maybe two inches. So it's, it doesn't go as far in as this area over here, but then again, this one went in about half an inch. So it is some improvement. So from the looks of it guys, this liquid aerator does seem to help it does seem to be working so if i were you guys go ahead and um, buy some try it out see if that helps out with your compact soil and see if it improves your lawn or not but yeah guys hope you enjoyed this video thanks so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one thanks